Hello and welcome to another Apex CCTV video tutorial. Today we will be talking about video balins. Video balins are used to replace the more traditional coaxial or RG59 cable used to transmit video and extend the maximum range when transmitting video. Here we have a coaxial cable with one end terminated and one end non-terminated. Video traveling on RG59 is limited to about 600 feet before the video quality starts to degrade. Video balins allow the signal to travel further over a Cat5e cable which is less expensive and easier installed. This is a Cat5e cable right here. This end is not terminated while this end has been terminated. There are two types of video balins, passive and active. Our passive video balins are good up to about 1200 feet. Active video balins can extend the range to about 4000 feet with these, but they do require power. What we have here is the VB4WP passive video balin. One balin will be connected to the camera, while the other balin will go to the DVR. In between the balins we will connect the Cat5 e cable or any twisted pair of 22 gauge wire. A standard Cat5 Ethernet cable will have four pairs of 22 gauge wire. When connecting to the video balin, we will use a pair of wires instead of just one. Here I'll go ahead and connect this Cat5 e cable to the balin. Here's an example of an active video balin. Power is required for this balin. This is where that would be connected. This balin right here is our receiver. This is a receiver in with the video out. And this balin is our transceiver, which is labeled here. And this has the video in. This has been a presentation of ApexCCTV.com.